Здравейте! Вие гледате Zoom с мен в начало и Тон Влашчика, който ви е известен от игра на тронове, като Джек и Хагар. Hi, how are you feeling at Comic Con in Bulgaria? It's great. I love being here. Um, I filmed a few projects in Bulgaria, so it's not my first time. Um, What is your impressions? I like it. I mean, it's a, it's a very diverse country. You've got everything. I mean, mountains, seaside, and a lot of untouched nature. Have you had the chance to look around? Not this time. Uh, right now, I'm only here for the weekend because I'm filming uh, something in Prague. Uh, but I was here on my first project ten uh, years ago. I was here for six weeks, and uh, whenever I had a day off, I rented a car and I was just driving around everywhere. You enjoy your thing. Yeah, yeah, it's cool. How you were cast for your role in Game of Thrones? Well, I had the audition for season two, and uh, so season one hadn't aired yet. So I had no idea what Game of Thrones was. Um, I had never heard of it. I just knew it was. My agent told me it's an American fantasy series uh, with some dragons, and and so I made an audition tape, and um, I got the part. And can you tell us something curious about your character, Dragon Hagar? Do I know? I know what you know. Um, <laughs> I, I, I don't have any additional information if you if that's what you're asking me. If you had the chance to play a new role all over again, which character would you choose to play? If I if I had the power to to be a different character, wow, that's it's hard. I mean, there's a lot of characters that I that I really like, yeah, especially the bad guys. I li I really liked King Joffrey and Ramsay Bolton, and because I think they 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 were the spicy ones. Like they, they like I I, I, I like their storylines. Okay, Game of Thrones is famous for killing many of its main characters. No one is safe in the world of George Martin. If you had the chance to shoot a scene in which you could kill any character in the series, whom would you choose? No, but as, as Jack and Hagar, I'm very zen, you know? I don't... I'm, if you're not. If I'm not. I don't... I, I'm, I'm, I'm very peaceful. Of course, I kill people all the time, but um, that's when I get paid or... You know, other characters pay me, so I don't have uh, an interest in um, just killing off people just like that. I'm, I think all the all the characters, uh, the remaining characters in Game of Thrones, uh, um, they're great, and I, I actually I wouldn't I wouldn't want to do without any of them. Can you tell us more about your relationship with Macy? How did she grow over the years? When I first met Macy, she was uh, 12. Or 13 years old, I think, and um, I was always amazed at uh, how how natural she uh, she acts in front of a camera. I mean, without having been to drama school or anything. So it's she's yeah, she's a real pro. She's a real natural, um, and it, it's been good fun um, uh, acting against her. It's um, are you still friends with her? We're still, we're, we're still friends. I mean, we're not in contact. I mean, she's she's really busy, and uh, but I follow her on Instagram. Do you think the face of Dragon Hagar could be cast in a role in any of the upcoming spin-off series of Game of Thrones? We heard rumors about them. I don't know if they're true. God, I have no idea. I, I heard that they're they're planning on doing prequels or sequels of prequels. I think. No idea. I... Would you join any of those projects if you had the chance? You're asking me difficult questions. Of course. I mean, if 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 it's a great story and but. The, the main thing now is to to wait for season eight and to to bring the original story to an end, and then everything that happens afterwards is uh, so it's a secret. We'll see. I, I uh, yeah, I know as much as you do. I don't have any knowledge. Okay, if you had to explain Game of Thrones to someone who doesn't know anything about the series, how would you describe it? What will be the shortest description you can give? I would give up. <laughs> I, would, I wouldn't even start. I mean, it's uh, it's totally tricky. I mean, you have to start watching it from the beginning. I mean, I've, I've, I've met a few people who tried to start watching it in season three because they thought, oh, everybody talks about it, now I want to see what it's about, and then you don't understand nothing. So it's uh, it's impossible to explain. It's a way, yeah. It's, in short words, it's... It's a whole fantasy world uh, in every detail with uh, characters uh, like 
multi-layered characters uh, fighting and scheming uh, for the ultimate power and to sit on the throne. What other projects are you working on currently? What can you tell us? Maybe a new movie? Well, what I can tell you, I did a Croatian movie earlier this year. It's called Escape to the Sea. They're in the cutting room at the moment, so I haven't seen anything. And I did a romantic comedy in England. Uh, it's called Thanks for the Memories. And I'm working on a project now, but I cannot talk about it yet. What is your ideal character? What kind of roles do you prefer to play? This is not how I... Uh, this is not how I approach the job. It's uh, what I like about being an actor is that I can try out all different things. So I wouldn't want to be in a long-running series always the same character um, because I imagine that would bore me at a certain point. So I want to I want to always try different things, and I'm always trying to do. Uh, different genres so that's why I choose drama and then comedy and then yeah and my last question is how do you manage not to lose yourself when you act it's not that easy <laughs> to save yourself from them no because um, I do have a list in my in my personal life with people I would like to kill uh, <laughs> so it's pretty much like Jack and Hagar or Aya in that respect but um, I haven't been talking in the third person about myself, so I think that's a good sign. Hello, I'm Tom Blaschia, and you are watching The Voice TV.